A Port St. Lucie mom turning her grief into an allergy and asthma awareness project. WPTV News Channel 5's Chris Gilmore shows you how Team Miranda Strong is inspiring others to explore city parks and honor a life cut short. Look closely as you pull into parks in Port St. Lucie, you might notice the pinwheels. They're a charming touch, but for PSL resident Susan D'Onofrio, they represent her Miranda. Even though she's not here physically, I feel her. I feel her presence all the time, and I talk about her all the time, and it's like she never left. Susan's daughter, Miranda D'Onofrio, was a 20-year-old junior at UCF when she passed away in November of 2017 after her allergies turned into a fatal asthma attack. Susan says losing her only child led to roughly a year of grieving before she decided to channel that energy into something else. How are we going to turn this around into a positive to bring more awareness to allergies and asthma? The answer was the creation of Team Miranda Strong. She partnered with the city to plant 250 pinwheels throughout parks with information from the Asthma and Allergy Foundation for America. She keeps the movement going through her scavenger hunt, encouraging people to post their photos of pinwheels to social media. Not only will you find pinwheels at the majority of parks here in Port St. Lucie, you'll eventually find these memorial rocks from Miranda, but that's not all Team Miranda Strong is doing. They're also honoring her memory through an annual scholarship for a deserving Port St. Lucie High School graduate. City staff say they're honored to team up with the Nofrio. I love this lady's courage uh, that she took something very sad. She took her grief into a thing that could yeah. touch other lives that could bring beauty to our environment. I want Miranda to know that everything is for her, that I want her legacy to, to live on. One sunflower at a time. In Port St. Lucie, Chris Gilmore, WPTV News Channel 5.